assalamu alaikum friends welcome back to civil engineers youtube channel dear friends today in this video i'm gonna talk about quantity of steel for beam column footing and slab by thumb rules that's why because uh, some students are asking uh, uh, the quantity of steel for beam column and footing uh, are for slab uh, by thumb rule so therefore uh, this is very important uh, and this is by thumb rule not by special method right so by thumb rules you can see for residential building for residential building per square feet we can take 4.5 kg to 4.75 kg 4.5 kg to 4.75 kg per square feet this is the weight of steel bar for example if you have 1000 square feet area and that you have to find the total quantity of steel bar so you can take for example 4.5 kg to 4.75 kg per square feet for one feet we can take 4.5 kg to 4.75 kg so if you have 1000 square area or 2000 square area or uh, 3000 uh, square feet area okay so uh, with this formula you can find the uh, quantity of steel for residential building now for commercial building you can take 5 kg to 5.5 kg per square feet 5 kg, 5 .5, 5 kg to 5.5 kg but this is for commercial building and this is for residential building right and after that you can calculate uh, uh, from your all area right and square feet this is n square feet for more accurate result you can also use bn data recommendations right bn data uh, is also a quantity uh, survey book specially for uh, materials okay so as per bn data the steel quantity used in different members of the building can be calculated easily using the following recommendation right you can read the bn data book right you can search in internet bn data book where you can find all about quantity survey right so structure member and percentage of steel so for slab 1% of total volume of concrete it means if you want to find the total quantity of steel bar for 100 for 100 so it means 1% 1 1% 1 of steel you should use for 1% of steel of 1% uh, 1% 1 of total volume of concrete so you can use 1% of total volume of concrete and for beam you can use 2% of total volume of concrete for beam so total uh, total volume of beam okay from that volume you can use two percent of steel bar and total volume of rcc slab concrete rcc slab right so you can use one percent of steel bar and for column you can use 2.5 percent of steel bar for total volume of concrete total volume of column and after that total volume of uh, total volume of column you can use 2.5 percent of column volume steel quantity right and for footing you can use 0.8 percent of total volume of concrete so these are very helpful which i have discussed the front of you guys so if you have any question about this and you can make a screenshot from this if you need uh, the bn data recommendation especially for uh, slab beam column and footing for steel bars by thumb rule so you can make a screenshot so it's uh, enough for today thanks for watching see you in next video goodbye